Hi everyone, Suzanne here. Welcome back to my Tomb Raider 4 The Last Revelation playthrough. Today we're going to be playing through the level Catacombs. So just a quick recap of the story so far. Lara has arrived in Alexandria and met up with her friend Jean Yves. He has told us that ultimately most of the parts of the armor of Horus will be found in Cleopatra's palaces, which we will have to dive to. But over the years, some other parts of the armor may also have ended up scattered into the catacombs. Now, Von Croy and his men were digging in the catacombs also, but they have now fled in terror due to Set and his apparitions in the catacombs. So our objective is to make our way through the catacombs, collect any parts of the armor that we can find, and also collect four tridents that will allow us to access the Temple of Poseidon. This is a really long, confusing, and complicated level, so let's just get into it. So into the catacombs we go. This is pretty cool. I like the... I like the set design here. Is that what you would call it? Set design? I'm not really sure. Oh, set design. <laughs> it's a pun and I didn't know it. I'm so lame. Okay. <laughs> okay, so I do believe that that... Oh, ooh. Um, yeah, so this floor goes down like that so we can't pull this so I do believe that thing we just saw um is back out here so we just have to hop back into the other level um yeah I think it's this stony thing Just drop down carefully and I do feel like I just have to say that today there is a guy outside cutting trees with a chainsaw so if you do hear a weird sound in the background it's just a chainsaw it's fine it's nothing to worry about at all uh, oh oh god I set myself on fire Okay, so don't run into the fire. Carefully. Careful. Okay. Great. Ugh. Okay. So, and does that just stay there? Or, oh, it does. Okay. Um, yeah, so I guess that rock falling. Oh, wow. She does not want to do what she's told today. Something freaky's going on. Maybe it's this torch. Hang on. Laura, get rid of that. Okay. So, yes, for some reason, that um, opened this. Just because. Just because. I don't feel like this is going well. So, yeah. We just open this door then. Again, I think that probably stumped a lot of people, like, because you need a key to open the main one of those to get into the catacombs, but then those other ones you can just open with a crowbar. I don't know. This game is mad. Actually mad. So when we pull this into place, then the floor should no longer go down. So that should have taken care of that problem. Okay, and then don't go towards the fire again. 
please. I can't take it anymore. <laughs> So yeah, let me just climb back up here. So yeah, I feel like I'm just going to cut out a lot of the backtracking in these levels because yeah, I just feel like it goes on forever. So yeah. Yay, so the floor stays up and we can pull this. So yeah, I do like this level, it just, it becomes tedious because of the skeletons. So I kind of wish they just let us have the catacombs where we could just wander around, but oh well, it's fine. <laughs> Won't complain too much. Um. Oh yeah, and I forgot to say as well that there are four secrets in this level, so obviously going to try and get all four secrets <gasps> okay so i have some info about this thing um but i just need to uh, uh don't fall over where is the where is the thing oh here it is okay um crouch Right, so this is an air wraith. So they are ghost spirits that can only be destroyed at magical crosses, like this one. Why is it killing me? Did I... Is this not the right thing? Why is it killing me? Oh god, there I was. I thought I was safe. And I would give like a lovely explanation <laughs> as to what that thing is but I guess not. no they both lead the same way that should have hello is it gone Oh guys, I'm so freaked out. Did that... <laughs> Obviously I'll find out when I watch the footage back, but did that wraith get destroyed? I thought it wasn't being destroyed, I thought it was attacking me. Oh god, well I guess it's gone. Um, That was so scary, oh my god. So, yes. They are ghost spirits that can only be destroyed at mystical crosses or um, totems, uh, I think Stella calls them. So yeah, anytime one of those wraiths appears, they're very similar to the um, fire wraith that we encountered in Tomb of Set. So yeah, anytime we encounter one of those wraiths, we need to find one of these totems or crosses in order to get rid of it or it'll just continuously attack us forever basically <laughs> oh, okay that was stressful but it's fine absolutely fine um so where do i go then do i go down here i think so okay That looks so fun. <laughs> looks really fun to slide down that. Ooh. Right, so yeah, the platform moved forward and away so we can't get back so the only option i think from here is to rope swing Ooh. 
Of course, we have to break for cinematic. Right. I swear I do like this game, even though I moan a ridiculous amount. Uh, okay, now hang on. Stop moving and no, that's... Can I look? That, that looks about right, doesn't it? Now I can't remember how to, oh, there we go. Oh no, that's not gonna work at all. Is that, uh, that should, um, we'll see. Oh, guys, I think I'm going to end up missing this now. Oh, uh, yeah. So I need to go a bit more like this way. That doesn't look right, though, does it? Although, mm, when she starts swinging, it looks more right. So, sure, look, we'll give it a go. Yes! Okay, and yeah, so you can swing right forward there, but we're gonna go this way for a secret. Can, right. Is, mm. Okay. Ooh, no. I did do a poll on my Instagram recently and I was like, do you like rope swinging or do you not? And yeah, 99% of people said they hate rope swinging. And that makes sense. Yes. Okay, we did it. I'm saving, I'm saving it right now. Right. Great. Secret. Totally not worth it to do the ropes. Oh well. That was a long fall. Um. Okay, so this leads us down onto the ground, but do you know what? We're going to go onto the ground later, I think. Yeah. We'll go to the ground later, so we'll just continue on up here for the moment. What's over here? Let's see. Check out these jars. Oh my god, it works! Okay, so on my last video, um, Boulder, thank you so much, suggested, because the F keys weren't working for me, so he suggested I just try the normal number <gasps> keys. Oh, crap, I used a medipack. Oh, it's fine. Um, to... Right, okay, so stay away from nine and zero to switch weapons and it works. Okay, so that's awesome. That'll make it handier if I remember what key <laughs> does what. Shoot it, please. Ugh. Okay. That's really cool. Thank you so much, Boulder. I have solved the mystery of how to change weapons quicker. <laughs> Thanks to you. Okay. Where's this leading me? Oh yes, okay, this big room. Okay. See, this place is like a maze. It's so confusing. Okay, so what was... No. There we go. Okay, so six is crossbow. Oh, and someone said to me, hang on, I do need to switch ammo, so just give me a second. Um, choose ammo, normal ammo. Someone did say that if you... Do I have the laser side? I do. 
if you use the laser sight and shoot off their head, they'll run around with no head. So, hang on a second. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we can zoom in now. Hang on. Ah! <laughs> oh my god, that's so funny! He just lost his head and jumped off the ledge. Okay, that's fine. I might try it again because he like fell off the ledge, but that was really, really funny. I, I enjoyed that. Thank you, Frank Wales, for that info. That was really, really fun. Okay, I'm gonna try it again. I'm gonna try it again properly. Right, so push this. Get some ledges. Uh, okay, is that a jump or a run and jump? A jump was perfectly fine. Oh, that's so handy. I love it. Okay. Exciting stuff. Oh. Another skeleton. I think I'm just going to blow him up because I kind of just want to move on from this section now. <gasps> oh, no. Stop it. Ugh. Right. And I know the totem is in here. Hopefully it actually works this time. Yay, there we go. So that's what should have happened last time. And maybe it did happen and I just didn't see it or didn't notice or something. I'm not sure. I feel like I'm not fully with it today or something. Okay, so what do I do now? Oh yeah, so it's these things over here. This is a quite long, difficult level, I think. But then Temple of Poseidon is super short and easy, so it kind of balances out. That is what I really like about Tomb Raider 4. You kind of have really long, complicated levels, and then you get given shorter, easier ones. So, you know, it's it kind of makes up for it whereas I feel like Tomb Raider 3 was just constant long complicated levels so yeah this one at least gives you a little bit of a break right uh, oh don't run off don't run off I don't think there's anything in those and honestly I'm not bothered checking <laughs> right so okay um, okay, so I'm gonna see if I can get get a thing, a skeleton thing again here. Hang on now. I guess they just they just fall off the ledge when I do it. So 
But I don't know, it's kind of addictive now. It's it's a pretty fun way to kill them, I have to admit. Okay, come on. Why are you stuck? Come on. Maybe if I shoot him in the butt, he'll- Oh, ah! Why won't it? Oh. Does it let me- Oh! It's really hard to do this on the keyboard. <gasps> no! Stop! <laughs> oh. He's annoying me now. I've just wasted like a ton of crossbow bullets. There- oh yes! Gotcha. I'm very much enjoying myself. <laughs> that was fab. I'm not gonna think about all the crossbow bolts I wasted. But do you know what? You don't really use them that much. That's the thing. So it's not like I would use that in combat or anything. So it's all good. Okay, I think... I think I want to go over here first. Oh, oh, that was handy, wasn't it? That was very handy indeed. That didn't come alive, no. So these are weird ones. These cause other things to appear in other places. I'm pretty sure. Not 100% sure how they work, but like you are. But like you shoot the jars and then, oh, uh, and then pickups appear in other places but they didn't though why what's happening where's my pickups Oh god. Oh, I don't know. I think I messed it up. But like, a thing of shotgun shells. And, oh. And a small medipack, I think, should have appeared. But, I don't know. I guess I, I guess I did it wrong. Okay, we've got a lot of skeletons now. Uh. 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 Oh no! I don't have my explosive ammo equipped. Cheese ammo. Explosive. Equipped. <gasps> uh. Oh, hang on. There's my small medipack. Did it, did it work then? But where's the, where's the shotgun shells? I am so confused. So confused. If you can solve this mystery, please, oh. <laughs> please let me know. Boom. Because I don't remember exactly where, but there should have been shotgun shells somewhere. 
oh well look we don't have time to dwell over shotgun shells um i don't think unless are they over here Well, I mean, if they were, I just blew them up really, didn't I? So, brilliant. Oh. Get these. And then there are more pickups. Then here, uh, is there anything? No. there. Well, I got some shotgun shells here, so it's not so bad. I guess. <laughs> I'm still just so upset. I don't understand what I did wrong. Maybe I shot that jar at the wrong time or something. I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I definitely don't see it anywhere, so... I think I just have to get over it, really. Get over it, move on. <laughs> We don't want to be here all day. Ugh! Oh! Great. Another- oh yeah, I forgot to say. So these are the tridents that we're collecting. So we've got two of them so far. And we need the tridents to open the Temple of Poseidon. Which we need to go into. Uh, in the catacombs so yeah we just need two more and I go oh, geez and I know one of these has something but as usual I don't remember which one. Oh, there crossbow bolts. I actually need those after messing around with the skeletons. <laughs> okay, I think I think we're doing okay. Uh, might just need to pick up the pace a bit, but we're oh flip. Why do I say that every time I say that something goes wrong? So I guess it needs to be like a precise jump so you don't hit your head. Hang on. Like this? Yeah. Oh. Uh, what is around here? Ooh. Oh. Use you. What do you keep pointing at? What is it? I don't know. Can I shoot this? It looks too big. Yeah, it's too big. Um, ooh, I don't know what that flashing light is. That's weird. Don't know if you can see that, but it's like a light flashing. It's creepy. Kind of like, is there someone taking pictures of me playing games? If so, that's a very boring thing to take pictures of, really, isn't it? Anyway. <laughs> so, we will slide back down here. And then, oh god. getting sick of those. 
So now we will go on to the floor. And of course, oh, get away. Oh, sprint, Lara, sprint. So this is the entrance to the Temple of Poseidon. But yeah, we need two more tridents before we can go in there. So let's go up here. I'm getting... Like, I'm getting a bit confused now. <laughs> I'm getting a bit confused and I'm trying to remember what to do next. It should be okay. Oh, okay, I remember this. So I think we go down here first. What's down here? What is this? What? Why is it going crazy? Oh, this is the lift. Wait, is this the secret lift that we go on later? I thought the secret lift was somewhere else though. I'm so confused. Where am I? Who am I? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know anymore and I can't see a thing. Right, so I think all of that was just for a pickup. Yeah, there's nothing in here. But yeah, I think that lift is for a so oh, is for a secret later. But I'm not 100% sure. What an arse. Right, come on then. Why won't you... Get off me. Get off. Get off. Can I just blow him up before he even gets up? Oh, I can, okay. I'm happy with that. I am very, very happy with that. Okay. So, oh yeah, okay, I remember this bit. So this is like a multi-layer, multi-layer room. So that's where we were and oh! And this is like the second layer. And then there's a third layer up. <laughs> I just actually feel like I am talking the most crap. <laughs> okay. Put that away because she doesn't really do the controls very well with it. So, uh. Okay, let me just check that there's. Oh! There's something here. Large medi pack. It's a good pickup. So, oh, don't fall down. Right, I think I just jump over here. Let's just do it. There's no more skeletons. We'll just jump 
Hang on, I heard something. Oh, I think that was my own footsteps. Sorry, I'm not very talkative right now. I'm just really trying to concentrate and not fall. Because that would be annoying. Okay. And then is there... What's in here? What is that? I'm sure that just drops you back down. I'd say that just drops you back down to the ground. We'll just keep going up. Just keep going up. Yeah. Great, so trident number three. Yes, trident number three. And... Uh, I think there's actually a pickup thingamabob here. Wonderful. is so confusing oh no oh oh ho, ho. <laughs> i just managed to save myself oh my god this is exactly why i'm concentrating so hard for this bit absolute madness okay oh i hear one boom so many ropes. Okay, and then this. Ooh. And I, oh. Haha, <laughs> that was great. And if you see that little door, oh hang on, is there something running around down there? Did I just see something? Am I imagining things? I could have sworn I saw something down there. I think I'm hallucinating. Um, yeah, that black door just there is a secret, so we will come back for it in a second. So, is it a jump for the- yeah, okay. Okay, we're s this is a really uncomfortable, like, view. Kind of like, weird view of her butt. <laughs> Just in the camera. <laughs> How awkward. Oh. Would you... Why won't you grab that? Okay. Uh, okay, so these are bone piles. And I do believe that there's... Use your short keys, Suzanne. I do believe that there are five of these bone piles, so we need to destroy each of them in order to get a secret. And then when we get that secret, it'll open that black door that we just saw. So, let me see if this works. No. <laughs> Maybe I need to stand further back. Hang on. There we go. Um, maybe... 
maybe an explosive arrow would do that. Oh. <laughs> Uh, I think I got a skeleton though, but obviously that's not gonna work, so let's just do it like this. <laughs> I'm so bad at this, like so bad. I'm wasting so much ammo. And then this should be the last bone pile. Yes, so that opened this. And then that opens the next one. So that's really cool. So we will go back and get that secret on our way back. It just makes more sense. Um, but I'm gonna grab this last trident. Great, I think that takes care of most of the skeletons. And then we're just gonna pop back up to coastal ruins just to open the doors and be, you know, complete because I like to be complete. And let's we'll see that is in our way. This oh. Ugh, hang on. Ugh, wait, wait, wait. Ah. What's down here? Hmm. I don't know, maybe I'll check it out in a bit. So we just open these two doors. And then this turns into like a shortcut into this part of the catacombs so that you don't have to run through the whole thing if you want to get down to that part. And yeah, this is where we were earlier in coastal ruins where we got some of the pickups and stuff like that. So um, yeah, it's pretty cool. So we'll just go back the way we came because it's the quickest and what is, oh, not there, but what is over here? I'm curious. Oh, it's literally just a pit, okay. <laughs> That's not that exciting. <gasps> God, that scared the crap out of me. Any more skeletons? <gasps> I almost fell to my death but I'm fine. Okay. Slide down and then, oh yeah. I was like, where am I going? Secret, Suzanne. I cannot keep my bearings in this level. It's just too confusing. And this is a great secret. You get a lot of stuff. Look at all that stuff. It's really worth it. Um, okay. So then I think now I just drop down. But I think the best place to drop down is over here. Because we need to go and get that secret lift. We can't um, forget that part. 
Actually, can I just... Instead of swinging, can I just drop down here? Well, I don't see why not. Let's give it a go. Here's the lift, yeah. And it is, yes, this is the thing we were in earlier. And now it works for some reason. I don't know why. But it just does. <laughs> oh, where is the opening? I feel like I'm doing a really bad job in this <gasps> level. I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm just struggling through. Absolutely struggling. And that is everything. And then we just go up here. What's this? Okay. And... Where do we- oh, Jesus. <gasps> oh no. I don't- I don't know where to go now. Oh, hang on. Stairs. Stairs seems good. And yes, this is exactly where I wanted to go. Okay, so I managed to find my way. So this is the entrance to the Temple of Poseidon. We have our four tridents. We got our four secrets, I think. Let me just double check the stats. So yes, we should have 48 out of 70, which we do. We have everything. So now let's enter the Temple of Poseidon. I cannot believe that I actually managed to do that. Okay, so success. I have to be honest, I was actually kind of dreading doing that level just because of how confusing it is. It feels like an absolute maze. I always get lost, always get confused doing that level. I feel like I did pretty good. Like I got all the secrets and I got all the tridents, which was the main things to get. Um, I'm still confused about that box of I believe it was shotgun shells that were supposed to appear and didn't appear so yeah if you do know what happened there do comment it below and let me know that was really fun I really enjoyed that so the next video is going to be temple of poseidon that is going to be a very very short video I think but then the level after that will be another pretty long one as well thank you so much for watching I do really appreciate it if you liked this video please do consider Consider subscribing it really does help to support me and supports me making more of these videos and I will see you very very soon in the next one